Farmers in the Berdahl Farms area just southeast of Austin's airport say they're not getting the same police service as other parts of the city. The city annexed a piece of land at the end of 2006. KXA's Chris Davis explains their primary concern on July 4th. It's uh, quiet. It was quiet. He keeps his yard clean. Now Henry Floyd wants Austin police to do the same for his neighborhood. You're looking for a present, a law enforcement present, and there isn't one. He says he's noticed more crime lately on the east edge of town, including this display around New Year's. He recorded this video from his camera doorbell right outside his front door. This looks like a war zone. He showed that video to city council last month asking for more regular police service. Austin police say there hasn't been a spike in crime here, but they are working to have two officers in the area more regularly instead of one. Debris on top of the houses, you can hear it hitting the windows. It's that's a really large amount of fireworks. Floyd and other neighbors worry about their houses catching fire in an Independence Day celebration tonight. I mean, there's no regard for any of your neighbors when you're putting off that kind of a display. APD says they'll have extra officers around here and all over, specifically to respond to 311 calls about illegal fireworks. Work with the community. Be part of our community. Floyd hopes that's just the start and the end to their personal fireworks shows. Chris Davis, KXAN News. It is illegal to shoot off fireworks within the Austin city limits or within 5,000 feet. That's close to a mile of city limits. There are still a few, uh, two significant unsolved homicide investigations near the Birdall Farms neighborhood. The bodies of four men were found after a house fire on Linden Road last September the 8th. Travis County deputies said drug deals may have played a role in this case, but so far no suspects. And just weeks later, on September 27th, a neighbor found the decomposed bodies of two men in a field on Pierce Lane. No arrests in that case either. On July the 9th, Austin police will be reorganizing to try to get commanders out in the community more. Right now, most commanders cover two sectors. This Sunday, that will change for two of them. Charlie and Henry sectors, both on the east side of Austin, will be split up between two commanders. So will sectors Baker and Ida towards the north and west. It'll be something of a test run for the department to see if it will work everywhere.